question seven. So let us um, simplify this as much as we can here. So let me expand this a bit. Okay, so we have these square brackets okay, on the left and the right hand side. So I will <coughs> simplify everything here. So first let's do that. So we have 2 times 26.98. So 2 times 26.98. And so it's 53.96. Okay, so now plus. <clears throat> Can bring the 3 inside. Okay, so right there, so we have 3 times 32.07, 96.21, plus 3 times 4, and let me write the remaining stuff on the side here. Okay, so I'm not done with the brackets because I can take these two like terms, which are just the numbers, and add them together. So let's do that. So let's add these up. Okay, so we have this. Now, <clears throat> I can take my factor, okay, and factor it in. So 4.3 times 150.17. So we have 645.731. Plus, then 4.3 times 12. Okay. Now I'm solving for um, the capital M. <clears throat> so I can take now my 645, so move it over. And I will have so 51.6m equals 2, so 1471 minus 645.731. Okay, so now if I do the subtraction, so 1471.331 minus 645.731 so we get 825.6 and that only leaves me now with this 51.6 in front of the M so it's a factor to get rid of the factor okay so we will divide both sides so that that factor cancels and now with the division okay we will get 16 and that is your final answer for this example okay